What's up, YouTube? Welcome to Code Index. So, in this tutorial, I'm going to explain you how you can build a website using Python. So, guys, we are going to build a portfolio website using Python. So, before doing that, make sure you have a class installed in your system. So, they go to your command prompt and click install class. I have already installed it. So guys, now in this Chrome class import class. After that, we will create a variable that says web. We will name it any. And I'm just giving you some basic things of how you can build this website. So make sure you are understanding this point. It is a very basic for making the websites very big website so make sure you are understanding or if you have any kind of doubt you can ask me in the comment box so let's create a method and last and here name just ignore this thing for now i'm going to explain you the later thing and after that the web dot and slash after that we are going to create a function let's say uh, limit and form or we will simply return let's say my website no my Website. After that, we'll create an if statement. If underscore my name equals to equals to underscore underscore name underscore underscore, then we are going to dot, dot. We are going to run our website. Web dot run equals to okay. just copy this code and run in your web shell here you can see that our debugger is active and you will get the link for your website or local host link simply follow this link and you can see the website has been created it looks very simple but we will modify it in our next set of next like, tutorials so guys when you make this by default it's stated as a home page but if you create another web router web dot root and here in this root you can create multiple pages Let's say we are, when we check the website. Uh, let me just give you a quick example about that. Let's say let's say uh, I'm in the website. I'm just giving you the kit example of that. When we visit any site, we have uh, tabs like this. So for at a base level, they have some. They are called pages. Let's say this is a bench of several pages, this is another, and this is another. So, to create these pages, a basic approach is to create, name the page here. And now, we create our function. Let's say, name the function about. And let's say, return about. Save it and let's try to run the website. Okay, if I put here uh, about page slash dot about, you can see that we get the about 
to the page. So this is simple. And let me just explain you this code. So we are importing class from the class library. It means we are uploading. We are getting this class method from this class library and underscore name is your python code which is getting to this underscore name and web router is just basically uh, we are creating a root for the code which we are running let's say the, the default way is our home page you can see that here and we have to specify the page so we can create here multiple page we can create another page you can make your own page what you are want but let me just just let you stay with me sorry guys I'm getting sleepy that's why I am fumbling but ignore that so guys you can create multiple pages so guys, if you have any kind of doubt, you can ask me in the comment box. So till then, thank you and meet you in the next tutorial.